Hello and welcome to The Right Angle. Today I'd like to have a little chat, tell you about someone. This someone was Maryam Mirzakhani. Possibly you have never heard of her, but she was a great mathematician and one of the modern ones. She sadly died three years ago. Now the story of Maryam certainly got my attention. She died young, unfortunately, to an illness. But she was one of the first women to get a Fields Medal. If you haven't heard of the Fields Medal, it is basically the equivalent of a Nobel Prize but this is awarded in mathematics. Now there's not much that I know about the kind of level of mathematics done by people like Mariam Mirzakhani, but I can try explaining the sort of problem she attacked. And this is a general problem. If you have a billiards table and you strike the ball hard and you have to imagine at this billiards table, the ball will keep bouncing and keep on bouncing indefinitely without any slowing down. Of course, it's an imaginary case. It's like a light, you know, a ray of light hitting mirrors on the side, right? So the problem is, will this ball, which keeps bouncing, will it cover the entire surface or will it keep repeating its pattern depending on the angle and at which point it is struck. So, what and how do we determine the pattern? What is the pattern and how do we determine the pattern? That is the kind of area that Mariam Mirzakhani worked in. Now, Mariam Mirzakhani was born in Iran, near Tehran, which is the capital and as a little girl she was fascinated by mathematics and her family encouraged it when she went to middle school a bit like some of you she met a friend and the friend's name was roya beheshti and she was also very fascinated with mathematics and they fortunately after some time got a teacher who really encouraged them who recognized their talents and these people went far above the class and they did problems just for the joy of it. And Mariam and Roya, they represented Iran in the International Mathematical Olympiad and Mariam won the gold medal on two consecutive years. No mean achievement. It is very, very hard. International Mathematical Olympiad problems are so difficult. Many of them I cannot do. But even before we dream about Mathematical Olympiads at the international level, even the Indian Mathematical Olympiad is quite hard. But most of you in school don't have to learn mathematics to anything like that level. And you don't need to. What we do here is enjoy mathematics to a certain level and be able to understand, be comfortable and apply it. However, there is joy in knowing this. Who knows? One of you might just go to the International Mathematical Olympiad. It is no mean achievement. Mariam finally in 2014 won the Fields Medal like I mentioned before. Fields Medal is given once in every four years, usually to four people, so that's about, works out to about maybe one per year, and it's usually given to only one person. Mariam won it for geometry, but it is not the kind of geometry you and I know. The simplest form of the problem is what I explained earlier, as a the billiards ball problem. I hope you take inspiration from someone like Mariam, a lady, a girl, but she did 
outstandingly well.